Hello Reading community. This past week has been a really difficult one in RPS as we've mourned the loss of two of beloved members of our RPS community. Our MHS student Theo Friedman and also ELA Coolidge teacher Mr. Jim Henderberry. Our thoughts continue to be with the Friedman family and the Henderberry family and also those who knew them both so well. I'd also just like to thank the community is one thing I've really appreciated about Reading is that in moments of challenge and difficulty, this is a community that really comes together to support one another and we've all felt that this week. So uh, thank you for all the support over the past, past week uh, and, and, ahead, and what's ahead. So this week we have two updates and some shout outs. So in terms of updates, uh, the written newsletter, you'll see a link to sign up for a uh, monthly newsletter from Dr. Chatterjee, who is our, our Reading's Director of Social Justice and Inclusion. We think that a lot of what's in the newsletter will be of interest to families, so please uh, take a minute and consider signing up for this communication. Also, uh, secondly, is a uh, vaccine clinic coming up through Vaccinate Rx. You'll see here the information in the written newsletter uh, upcoming on October 28th at Coolidge Middle School from 2 to 6 p.m. Uh, so that's a, a link in the to sign up for those who are interested is in the written newsletter. Shifting into some shout outs. First shout out goes to RMHS student Althea Kulaba. And I'd like to give a little bit of context first. Uh, so as the community knows, over the past month, we've celebrated Hispanic Heritage Month across all of our schools. And I think you've seen evidence of that in a lot of our uh, school specific newsletters of the ways that we've recognized and celebrated this past month. Uh, we also received a note from Althea Kulaba uh, with the idea of also celebrating uh, Filipino American Heritage Month, also with the broader goal of raising awareness around uh, the many different cultures that we have here in our RPS community. So um, Althea, who identifies as Filipino American, put together a uh, speech in response to a video that she saw about uh, Larry Itliong, who was a leader in the Filipino American community back in the 1960s. So I encourage you all to check out the speech that Althea put together in the video that connects to it. Uh, and I'd also just like to thank Althea for, uh, for providing us all with this learning opportunity and for her leadership and advocacy in our community. So thank you and a shout out to Althea and I hope you all check out the work that she put together. Also like to give a shout out to Dan McGrath. Uh, he's the RMHS boys soccer coach here. He was just named as the 2021-2022 uh, MIAA statewide coach of the year for boys soccer. So uh, congratulations, Coach McGrath. So this award is presented each year um, to someone, a coach in each individual sport uh, based off of character, impact on students in the community, and on coaching credentials. So thank you to Coach McGrath for the impact you continue to have on our students. And then to close, we'll leave you here with some photos from the trip that's ongoing, the Parker Middle School Nature's Classroom trip to Yarmouth, Mass. You'll see if you click on the Twitter handle here for Parker, you'll also see some fun and exciting videos as well. Uh, the reports are the students are learning a ton and having a great time. I'd like to give a special shout out to all those staff members who went to chaperone on the trip. That's Andy Spinelli, Brian Cormier, Eric Goldstein, Delaney Yule, uh, Patrick Colbert, Jess Doherty, Rochelle Rubino, and Richard Cahey. So thank you uh, for spending your time with our students over at Nature's Classroom and enjoy some of the videos and the pictures. Uh, we hope you have a great weekend. Go Rockets!